All right, this was actually at the tail end of the workout, just hitting this uh, Armored Fitness XPO sled push doing, uh, oh, it's about, I think it's close to about 100 yards here. Um, I did this uh, three rounds. Uh, my son is kind enough to do the filming out here, and so uh, I think he did a pretty good job. Anyway, just uh, got a little bit of a sore heel, so this has been a little bit of a challenge, but nonetheless, it's kind of pushed on. Uh, you have to turn that thing around. It's a little bit of pain doing that thing. But this thing, you know, basically gives you feedback. The harder you push, the harder it is. Uh, and so it's a pretty good, as you might imagine, pretty good leg workout, glutes, hamstrings, so on and so forth, calves. So it's a nice little push, good conditioning. And again, this distance was just enough to where it got fairly tough. So like I said, I did three rounds of this at the end of the workout. And the workout can basically consist of doing some snatch stuff. These are snatch grip, high pulls. I'm hitting that PVC pipe there on the far right side, you know, trying to get that height. That's about nipple high for me. And so that is where I like to try to get these in. 225, haven't done these in about five years. And so same thing with these snatch grip deadlifts. Again, uh, biggest difficulty here is obviously more range of motion, but thumbs got the hook grip going. So thumbs are getting a little beat up on these, but these felt pretty good. I'll uh, likely start adding these back in. I think the benefits, particularly the high pulls are, are tremendous, uh, a good exercise.